<laughs> What's up, guys? We watched Reservoir Dogs. Man, that movie was straight theater. Then we watched Pulp Fiction. That movie was crazy. Jackie Brown. Uh, that movie was funky. I liked it. <laughs> Kill Bill Volume 1. Iconic. Kill Bill Volume 2. Masterpiece. And now we're on to Death Proof. So I'm really excited for this movie, obviously, because Quentin Tarantino is very unique, man. He's batting so, a thousand in our world. Well, so many people tried to explain what makes this man such a great director, but I, I still haven't really seen anyone put their finger on it because it's just hard to explain. Right. So oh, like, comment, subscribe, man. This is Death Proof. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If I have to censor it, that's on me. I always <laughs> try to get it to pass on YouTube, but they add suitability to the videos. And listen, guys, if they tell me I have to censor it more, then I'll put it back on there. We never pass the first time. Never. never. So I always put these videos on there at least two or three times before I finally censor everything, but they never pass the videos, man. So that's just what it is so uh let's go let's go two thousand seven we do know that and that's the year the patriots lost the super bowl to the giants i think i was a freshman in high school because bill belichick went zero blitz <laughs> he did. like i was a freshman in high school Back and that's what you remember touchdown. <laughs> what the heck Game over. You know? brady hit moss though so close oh yeah i love the beginning we should put that on our videos. Why haven't we? Because we're just now watching it? No, he, that's at the beginning of all of them. <laughs> lions only? <laughs> Leopards only? <laughs> Tenthas only? Why do I feel like a lot of dudes did a lot of blow to this? <laughs> Back Mark, in the day. Mark Frank. Yeah. <laughs> Dino. She's got a cool kitchen though. I mean, yeah. A nice open floor. Look, room. look, she's doing the same thing that that picture's doing. <laughs> it looks like um, Karen Wheeler. Woo! Hell yeah, boys! Woo! Yeah, brother! You know that little pool house where them dudes play pool at the end of our road? Yeah. That's where I picture them watching. They probably at. watch this yeah. on the big screen while they sniff blow off the pool table. It's like Max all Stranger Things when she gets older. <laughs> Harvey Weinstein. There's nothing worse than having to pee like that. Where you gotta clamp it with your fingers? Is that a thing? You know? Who's holding? If you're not, then nobody. We were kinda hoping you were. How are you not holding? Jesus Christ, Shannon. It is not my f job to supply y'all with weed when we go out. You're getting angry kinda quick, don't you think? I was just teasing you. I'm not angry. It just would be nice if y'all didn't just count on me all the time. Prize me every once in a while with pot. Come on, guys. Fine, I'll pay for it when we get some. It's about the pain in the ass of scoring. And two, we're not really fighting. Harley, forgotten what hanging out with Jungle Julie is like. I don't want to fight. That's how we tolerate each other after all these years. Oh, billboard. <laughs> so what's the plan, <laughs> man? Margaritas and Mexican food aguaros. Did you call Raphael and tell him we're coming? Of course. You're so good. I know. Okay, is Christian Salmonson gonna be there? I bet your ass he is. Gonna be there with Jesse Letterman. Christian Salmonson, the filmmakers in town. He's got a big thing for Julia. If he had a big thing for me, he'd call me as opposed to disappearing for six months and he'd get his ass down here more often than he does. And on my birthday, he'd give me a f***ing phone call. Oh, Billboard! This is like every other Tarantino movie. <laughs> the dialogue. Yeah. So she must be like a damn stripper or something. She's like a celebrity. <laughs> what happened to you and me last night? Well, you know, not much. We just at each other. I mean, if you don't bust their balls a little bit, they're never going to respect you. Okay, we're pretty clear on <laughs> like what it voice. is you didn't do. How about enlightening us on what it is you did do? Just made out on the couch for about 20 minutes. Dressed, half dressed or naked? Dressed. They said we made out. We didn't do the thing. Call it the thing? I call it the thing. You guys like the thing? They like it better than no thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to get back to what it is you did do. So you're making out on the couch with me, right? Correct. This couch is the one in your hotel room. What am I, stupid over here? Mine. Are you making out sitting I'm up or lying down? We started sitting up, we worked our way to lying down. Hmm, the flat thickens. Who was on top? I was straddling him. I mean, he's cute and all, but Jesse Letterman's gonna be all mm -hmm. over her. Jesse Letterman. Remember, no hooking up tonight. Because we are driving to Lake LBJ tonight. My daddy's pretty clear about one thing. He said, I am letting you and your girlfriend stay at my lake house. Not <laughs> you and a bunch of horny boys trying to get their <laughs> home with my daughter. Can I talk <laughs> like that? Hell oh, yeah. I have my own relationship with Ben, and you're just jealous because it don't include you. you call her dad Ben? <laughs> I'm not a child, that's his name. 
That's your last billboard before Guero's. Oh, come on, give me a break. Oh, come on my ass. We said every time. Okay. I feel like this is a long car ride. I know. Jungle Julia. I dare you not to wake up with me. <laughs> what? Oh, they're being followed. Jules, will be good, right? Thanks. I like the vibe of this movie because I feel like I'm there in that Well, weird you time. always feel like you're there. In that crazy time, though. What do you mean? Like, it just feels like an older time. Like, it's a time capsule in a way? Mm hmm. Yeah. I'm like, cool. Hey, you want to join us? For a second, but I'm with some friends. Oh, so you must be the infamous butterfly. Shh. She don't know nothing about it. Know about what? When are y'all going to tell her? Soon. Tell me why. Yeah, now thanks to you, we got to tell her sooner than later. All right, cut the shit. What the f*** is going on? I said a little something, something about you on the air today. Julia, what the f*** did you say about me on the radio? Anywho, I could explain what I said, which would be boring. Or Marcy over here, who is an incredible actress, could act it out for you, which I think will give you a better idea of what you have in store for you tonight. Okay, so just tell me your way. So we'll act it out with Marcy? Sure. Okay, give Marcy <laughs> a drink. Okay, so you're in a club or a bar and Marcy cute or kind or kind of sexy or better be hysterically, but not funny looking guy who you could f Got it. Marcy, take it. Howdy. <laughs> Hi there. Name wouldn't be Butterfly, would it? Yes, it is. It's you got me at a disadvantage. Barry. It's me. <laughs> Y'all are getting Barry. me hot. So is a Butterfly your real name? Yes, it is. And how'd you know my name? I listened to Jungle Julia's show this morning. Oh, you did, did you? Oh, yeah, I listen to her show every morning. <laughs> oh, you do? Yeah, she's like the coolest lady in town. <laughs> well, don't you think she's got a big ass? Nah, man, I like her ass that way. <laughs> she got a black girl's ass. She's got a big ass. Okay, what the f*** are you doing? Oh, look who wants to get black men and a whole lot of mother White men have had plenty fun adoring my ass. I don't wear their teeth marks on my butt for nothing. All right, if you're not gonna buy me a <laughs> oh, drink, she's got scars. Back? So, Butterfly, <laughs> can I buy you a drink? I'd love one. Well, can I get you? I take a margarita. Here you go. So, after they buy you a drink, when they raise their glass to toast, they look you dead in the eye and repeat this poem The woods are lovely, dark, and deep. And then they say, You gotta give them a lap dance. What? <laughs> Call your butterfly, buy your drink for people. Uh-uh. Any photos of them? <clears throat> Bro, that's the dude from uh Guardians of the Galaxy, yeah, right? It's Peter Quill's yeah. dad. <laughs> and obviously. What's his name? Ego? Right. I wonder if her brain moved around. Right, like I'd have a headache. <laughs> Any dead soldiers here? Uh, at least two. Thank you. Where the hell is Lena Frank? <laughs> <laughs> Lena Frank, where are you? <laughs> well, come over already. We're waiting for you. Shauna and the girls at the lake house this weekend? Shauna? Oh. Now, there is one thing that every girl in the whole world whose name is Shanna has in common with each other. We all hate the name Shauna. We really hate it when people call it Shauna. <laughs> I don't know a Shanna, personally. Me either. Damn, that was so inefficient. How long it took her to do the exclamation points? Yeah. Just remember, it's Shanna Banana, not Shauna Banana. Oh. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't bullish, but. Oh, Shanna Banana. That guy's been staring at her the whole time. <laughs> Do them. What? Hey, 
Them's the rules, baby. Warren says it, we do it. I love that philosophy. Warren says it, we do it. So let's there he is. do <laughs> it. That's the bartender, yeah. Hey, shock first questions later. Here we go. Post time. Is that a tasty banana, a tasty beverage? What the f is it? Beverage. Shock <laughs> So good they named the color after. <laughs> <laughs> Going out for a smoke. Okay, but careful when you keep that hot flame, all right? You blow up the joints. Oh, hey, Punky. Uh, one of the lights is off in the parking lot. Flip it. <laughs> <laughs> What's his voice though? <laughs> He's like, flip it. She just goes. Oh, jeez! Whoa, whoa. Jeez! Right. You asshole! I swear, Arlene, I was not trying to scare you. Oh, uh, hearty tomorrow. Go inside. Wait a minute. Why? Thinking we could make out? What, on a porch? Not even in the bar, but in front of the entrance? Forget it. No, in my car. What, out there? It's what is numb out there. Not in my car, it's not. Look, you won't get wet. I promise. Dang, he came prepared. Absolutely. He took the words <laughs> you know, right out my mouth. wouldn't brag about that. Ha, ha, ha. His is so I, vibrant. You know what I mean. Okay, let's go. What the hell? Oh, you got two jobs. Kiss good and make sure my hair don't get wet. <laughs> Look, you can't look like you're trying to get her out of here before Christian Simonson shows up. You've got to get her out of here. Christian Simonson shows up. What's the point? They're going to Shanna's daddy's house at Lake LBJ and it's no guys. So after we bring the girls' drinks, in fairly rapid order, but not obvious, we order two more rounds of shots. You think they're gonna fall for that? We'll I thought that was Ryan Reynolds for a second. Now it's time to turn up the volume. I'm gonna around. We go to Jaeger shots. Man, they're not gonna drink Jaeger shots. Dude, it's a guy's buying the booze. Drink anything. Do that. We'll see if they got another Jaeger shot in them. You never know. That could be the shot that puts them past the point of fuck it. Then all of a sudden, no guys at the lake house turns into a couple of guys at the lake house. Right, boy, exactly. I know I can at least get Shan to suck my banana to a buttery nipple shot. It's Julia's sweet shot. Key lamp pie. Oh, come on, you can Leroy Brown do one more for dessert. <laughs> Check it out. I <laughs> wonder if BJ brought the bear with him. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Are you getting the vibe that he's gonna murder those dudes? Dude, cut himself. That's what I'm thinking. His time machine. <laughs> Where's he gonna like cut him out? Chicken. He's sponsored by Icy Hot. No mess, Bagley. Deputy Batman Stagley. The high sheriff fans. Guys, let me know. Is that the dude who plays in that show, like Heroes, back in the day? Nate was gentlemanly enough to escort me with his you umbrella. Ah, uh, good for you, Nate. You see that pretty girl sitting by herself at the bar? Who, the dirty hippie? No, she's not a hippie. She might as well be a hippie. <laughs> Why are they doing all this judging? Thank you, Tip. Do you know what just happened to her? No, but I know she's a skinny, fake, blonde bitch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Warren! Is there anybody in this place you could vouch for to give me a ride home? Fair lady, your chariot awaits. You've been eavesdropping? <laughs> eavesdropping and can't help but here. I think I belong in the latter category. So, uh, icy hot, you offering me a ride home? I'm offering you a lift. If when I'm ready to leave, you are too. And when are you thinking about leaving? Truthfully, I'm not thinking about it. When I do, you will be the first to know. Will you be able to, uh, drive later? I know looks can be deceiving, but I'm a teetotaler. I've been drinking club soda and lime all night, and now I'm building up to my big drink. Which is what? Virgin Pina Colada. Okay, why would someone who doesn't drink spend hours at a bar? You know, a bar offers all kind of things other than alcohol. Hmm, really? Like what? <laughs> Nacho Grande Platters. The Fellowship. Fascinating individuals like Warren here. Alcohol is just a lubricant for all the individual encounters that a bar room offers. That cowboy? I'm not a cowboy, Pam. I'm a stuntman, but that's a very easy mistake to make. You know my name. When you were talking with Warren, couldn't help it over here. Fair enough. So what's your name, I see? Stuntman Mike. Stuntman Mike's your name. You ask anybody. Hey, Warren, who is this guy? Stuntman Mike. 
<laughs> they put Warren to work tonight. Yeah, he's a busy man, ain't he? Yeah. When that guy started yeah. talking, it sort of threw me off. I thought he'd be a little different. Let's give it. Hello, Pam. Well, Stuntman Mike, can I buy you that virgin pina colada? Be lovely. So was he just like coconut or something? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the font of her tattoo looks like the side of the damn Scooby Doo car. You don't know. Uh, I can't really see it though. But yeah. That's Linda Frank. Take a picture. Oh, That's Lord. longer. That's who's bringing the pot. Right. What? The table seems to keep um, getting your attention. Is that the girl from the billboard outside? Yep. She sure is a striking looking woman. Look at that hair. Lots of leave-in conditioner. Is that jealousy I detect? Hardly. But if you want to get with Jungle Julia, there's a real easy way to do that. Really? What would that be? Famous. You won't have to find her, she'll find you. And you don't even want to know what she did for that. Enjoy it. Sucker, you burned it. <laughs> we went to school together. She's probably telling the truth, though, isn't she? School. That's what she did to me. She was her height right now at 12. She was a monster. Half the guys she still fucks from the old class, she used to beat up and terrorize in the fifth grade. I see, and she used to beat you up and take your chocolate milk, huh? That pituitary case? Might have kicked my ass a couple of times. Sorry, <laughs> I'm built like a girl, not a black man. God, before I ever gave Julia Lukai my chocolate milk. A rebel, huh? <laughs> They have some long-term beef. There it is, that toe shot. That was a good one. Toes <laughs> in the ring. We haven't Pretty seen unique. that before. Yeah, last time they were kicking someone in the forehead. Hey, are you famous or something? Or something. No, 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 really. Hey, what, what do you do? Really? What I do is work my ass off to get my own record label off the ground. But why that girl wanted a picture of me because I'm a local DJ. Wait a minute. You got a billboard by Big Kahuna Burger, don't you? Hey. Yeah. Jungle Julia Lukai. Stuntman Mike McKay. Now, my friends and I are going to continue to get our weed on. Would you care for some? Thank you, Julia. But just the same. No thanks. So. I kind of like that jacket. I'm just wondering what's the deal, though. I mean, obviously he's stalking them, but... You think they have a history or something? Sorry, nothing. The uh heck? -huh. I don't know. To answer your question, I don't know. You got some voucher here. I asked him what movies you worked on. No f***ing clue. You know the show The Virginian? Nope. There's another rat that show, Gary Clark, and I looked like him a bit. Anyway, I did a lot of Virginians doubling Gary Clark. And, uh... And that show turned into the men of Shiloh. They brought on Lee Majors, and I doubled him. Do you know any of these shows or people I'm talking about? Sorry. So, how exactly does one become a stuntman, stuntman Mike? Well, in Hollywood, fool enough to throw himself down a flight of stairs can usually find somebody to pay him. But really, I, I got into the business the way most people get in the stunt business. How's that? My brother got me in it. Who's your brother? Stuntman Bob. <laughs> <laughs> She's not happy. The comments are like, it's an asshole. Yeah. Star, stars aren't. Mm -hmm. Anywho, I'm sorry. You forgive me? But you have to be real nice to me for the whole rest of the time I'm here. You ready to go to the lake? Got your little friend. You want to bring him? I don't know, boy. You want him to come? She had one mind. So how about it? Boys Playing or just work, us didn't girls? It. <laughs> us girls. Good idea. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Cheers, butterfly. Okay. The woods are lovely oh, dark no. and deep, and I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep. No. Did you hear me, butterfly? You already did it. Miles to go before you sleep. Sorry, stuntman Bert. Mike. <laughs> Mike, she already broke off that dance. Is that true? Did I miss my chance? Do I frighten you? Is it my scar? Your car. Ah, sorry. 
It's my mom's car. <laughs> Have you been following us? <laughs> no. Dina scared before? I saw him outside of Guero's. And I saw you outside Guero's, too. You saw my car, I saw your legs. Now, look, I ain't stalking y'all, but I didn't say it wasn't a wolf. So you really weren't following us? I'm not following. Got lucky. So? How about that lap dance? Sorry, it was a one-time only offer, and she did it earlier this evening at Antone's. No, she didn't. How do you know? I'm good that way. He was probably there. And you look a little too shaped. What's He's been shaped? following her all day. Wounded. Why should I be wounded? Because you expected guys to be pestering. From your look, I can tell nobody pestered you at all. That kind of hurt your feelings a little bit, didn't it? There are a few things as fetching as a bruised ego on a beautiful angel. So, how about that lap dance? I'm gonna have to give you a rain check. I understand if I make you uncomfortable. You're still a nice girl. You know how people say, you're okay in my book, or in you my book, that's <laughs> no good. Well, I actually have a book. Mm. And everybody I ever meet goes in this book, and now I've met you, and you're going in the book. And what if I did it? Oh. Why don't you go get ready for your lap dance? The build-up to this movie has been, like, bizarre, has it not? <laughs> it's been so... Just ominous and creepy. <laughs> oh, he actually gets it, huh? She's going for it. She, she's doing her best, <laughs> ain't she? She looked like her lower back hurt a little bit. Look, that lady, I don't know how she feels about it because she was like vibing with him at the bar. She looks into it enough. <laughs> It's <laughs> just like every, they all stopped to watch this. Right. I'm just watching it. I'm trying not to interrupt, I guess. <laughs> Maybe in this universe, he's like planting a seed with her. Well, in my mind, I keep thinking he's going to try to kill her. Isn't that not the vibe you're getting? I think so. <laughs> she looks like she's done that a lot. Yeah, she is prepared for this moment. She might as well have some damn stock in that bar. <laughs> be a part owner. Well, she's just visiting for the weekend. She had to be remembered as a butterfly. <laughs> yes. The whole time I'm like, you know this dude wants to kill you, right? Yeah. I guess she doesn't know. Hi. I was going to come here and said. Wow, that's scary. Yeah, well, I wanted it depressive. Scary tends to impress. Is it safe? No, oh, it's better than safe. It's death proof. Yeah. Ooh. You make a car death proof. Well, that's what stunt men do. You've seen a movie where a car gets into some smash up there ain't no way in hell anybody's walking away from. It. Yeah. Well, how do you think they accomplish that? EGI? <laughs> real cars smashing into real cars. That makes sense. I just didn't know you could make a car death proof. This just feels Tarantino though. Yeah, absolutely. Just like the dialogue and like the way they're shooting. Why is your passenger it? seat in a box? Well, this is a movie car. Sometimes when you're shooting a crash, director wants to put a camera in the car. He's a whole damn stuntman for real, huh? Yeah. I thought that was just his code name. You know, when you asked <laughs> to drive me home, you didn't mention your car didn't have a passenger seat. Yeah. Well, actually, I didn't ask to drive you. You asked me for a ride, and I said, yeah. Yeah, but who says he won't barrel roll? Like, you think he's going to put stunt on Like, the if home? he's a stuntman, he can just go over a ramp on he the way He likes to get paid for it. Maybe he's dangerous. He might knock them off the highway. <laughs> he looked at you like, yeah, I might. <laughs> Good idea. Which way are you going? Left or right? Right. Ah, uh, that's too bad. Hi. Uh-oh. <laughs> Since you're going the other way, I'm afraid you're going to have to start getting scared immediately. <laughs> There is no way. So he said, forget guns and all that. I have a car. I'm just going to beat you to death. He's two for two on being wild. <laughs> this is kind of insane, isn't it? Sorry, guys. I've just been so captivation land since I started watching this, I guess. Like, we were at a grimy bar watching lap dances, and now we're beating people up. Well, the comments always tell us to shut up during Tarantino, so I'm trying not to talk that much. joke. It's super funny. I'm a joke. I'm 
Yeah, Bye. you're blonde. Everything, please. Bye. Just, just let me out, please. And remember when I said this car was death proof? Well, that wasn't a lie. This car is 100% death proof. Only please. to get the benefit of it, honey. You really need to be sitting in my seat. Ah. a new way to kill somebody i've never seen that i'm sitting there thinking is this man about to run no, no, into no, no, something no, no. wait who's driving <laughs> oh her <laughs> here he goes they're so carefree, they have no idea. They're like hella carefree, ain't they? <laughs> this man's wild. Just a quick game of chicken, huh? Oh my gosh. <laughs> There is no Are way. Are you oh. kidding? <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that sound effect, bro? But which one's the real one? <laughs> what? Which one happened? I know it was the same. From, they just showed it multiple times because that was a gnarly shot. Oh. You gotta show that off. Well, hold on, guys. No, I don't want to see it again. I don't no, no, see it, again. it was that sound effect for me. That ah! <laughs> you know the one they use in like the YouTube videos. No one watches. Yeah. Guys, what the hell are we watching? <laughs> I tried to be great. quiet and just not talk the opening act, but geez, this show is unbelievably weird. <laughs> like I like it. I'm having so much fun, but this is so strange. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> like what? We're new to Tarantino, so the hanging out part was just at the bar that we get with Damn. everyone. Yeah. Patient's prognosis, Doctor Block. I don't really see it's any of your business. Come on now, sis. You just tell us how bad is it? <laughs> he got banged up real good. Busted nose, broken collarbone, smashed up his left index finger. Is that it? He was real lucky. <laughs> That'll be all. Why? That's more than enough, and I want to thank you, Doctor Block. <laughs> what I think is a goddamn ghoulish. I hesitate to speak. Haven't we it heard loud. someone do that before? And kill Bill. I'll give it a shot. Well, what we have here is a case of vehicle homicide. That old boy in there murdered them pretty little gals. The car, not a hatchet. They did. This is. Well, what are you gonna do? A goddamn thing. The DA says ain't no crime here. There one of them gals was swimming in alcohol, floating on weed. An old hooper in there. He might clean as a whistle. Now you actually you think that he premeditatively murdered them gals? Well, I can't prove it, but since thinking don't cost nothing, I can think it, and I do. Yeah, but Pop, he got pretty banged up himself. Well, hell yeah, he got banged up. Damn, I mean, them pretty old gals now look like a goddamn giant to chew them up and spit them out. <laughs> Did any of them survive? 200 miles an hour, flesh and bone, and plain old Newton. They all princess died. You can cough, you get it out. No, I'm good. He said they all princess died. Like Princess Why? Diana. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess to me, it's a sex thing. No way I can figure. High velocity impact, all four souls taken exactly at the same time. Probably the way that diabolical degenerate can shoot his goo. Yeah, I think the only thing I'm dreaming of getting that bastard on is vehicle manslaughter for the hitchhiker in the death box. I'm just plain old goddamn reckless and dangerous. But I got me a oh, goddamn wow. bartender going to testify to old stunt man Mike. Didn't drink a drop all night. And his passion Morning. was left stranded by her date in the goddamn rain. No let him for the... Right now, on paper, this will look like he's just trying to help her out. That's what jury's gonna say. So what are you gonna do, Pop? Myself, work the case, you know, I'm off. I search for evidence, you prove my theory. <laughs> Clear authority. Dog that 
rotten son of a bitch wherever he goes, I go. I could spend the same goddamn amount of time and energy falling the NASCAR. So, hmm, oh, hey. I thought about it a lot. I think I'd have a hell of a lot happier life if I did the latter. And just because I can't punish old Frankenstein there for what he's done, I'm gonna tell you like the Lord told John. If he ever does it again, I can be goddamn sure he don't do it in Texas. Yeah. <laughs> okay, weapon on Tennessee. I thought those characters was with us <laughs> to the end of the movie, but I guess not. This is crazy. They always said don't put your foot out the window for that reason. That was crazy. Hot heads too. Just casual black and white. To show us the past or something, obviously. That said 14 months later. Oh, did it really? Damn, sorry, I missed that. You're gonna drown. You don't know how that talking about. So Stuntman Mike's about them toes, too. So how's the rock as a kisser? Mm, he's damn good. <laughs> <laughs> he's got them mushy lips. Mm, I love them mushy lips. Damn, that sounds sexy. Mm, it was sexy. Since you're getting that, can you get some more vodka and some more sugar-free Red Bull? <laughs> we didn't know you were awake. Why is it so similar? I, I know. It's bizarre. Sugar-free red mm. bull anyway. That's weird because it's like the same it's conversation. There must be a what stereotype in that town or something. Because <laughs> you gonna drive. In groups of three. <laughs> the big A cup of coffee. <laughs> Let's go by the lake. I Imagine how creepy that'd be though. If you're at the gas station, this random guy walked up like this. Started stalking on you. And you're just like kind of minding your own business. <laughs> yeah, just trying to get your toes tan. <laughs> what the heck? Why'd you peep in there? <laughs> Is it true about you? And she's trying to get discovered. They should you just touched your foot. Bro, somebody just touched your foot. It you don't even know it. Oh my god. <laughs> She's oh, a sleeping mask. <laughs> no. I don't want nobody. Now we're my key. Here they are. Oh, Ugh. Sorry. Clear. No, that wasn't you. I'm like grossed out for all parties involved. I'm sticking your tongue on her toes. That's Daredevil's nurse. What are you doing? Yeah, Matt Murdock's gonna beat your ass. Why did he do it? <laughs> That's like Quentin Tarantino's fantasy on the low. You're just putting it on the screen. That made my hair on my neck stand up. <laughs> like, dude, if my toes are just out of a window, someone licks on my suit. And somebody's getting shot. A little bit. <laughs> Clearly. I might as well hit the ATM. Give me a smoke. Brand X. Those are cute. Are they? I was thinking she looked kind of crazy. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell? She has like some gaucho style pants on, but I like the boot. She looks like she downloaded a lot of music off LimeWire. I mean, didn't we all with the Bill Clinton thing? <laughs> <laughs> didn't we all? My fellow Americans. <laughs> didn't we all? You heard me. I mean, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. No one did that. I used to think they were going to take us or everything. We all Every time someone knocked on the door, I'd be like, oh, God, it's, oh, it's LimeWire. <laughs> Does it say Vipers? Seal Bill. What? Nothing, honey. That's the Bruce Lee car right there. <laughs> Yellow. It's me. Miss me. Best get your ass off Kim's car. I've seen Kim's see car before. Right <gasps> Her ass ain't your ass. The references. Okay. You got a lure? Magazine's by the window. Here you are. <laughs> What's a lore like a makeup magazine or something? Yeah, they like rate products and stuff. Thank you very or something. Much. When did she come in the picture? Is that her their group of weed weed dealer? <laughs> or something? Yeah, maybe. There's always a fourth, right? <laughs> yeah. 
She's familiar too. She plays in something. Who, right there? Yeah, she plays in something. She was like a doctor or a nurse or something. Yeah, on TV. Daredevils. No, 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 not her. The other way. That lady? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's like, ooh, boy. He's so timing crazy. couldn't be better, Zoe. It just so happens we're all three off duty the next three days of show. How does that happen? Well, I'm doing Lindsay Lohan's makeup. She's off for the next three days. No stunts being filmed during that time, so Kim's free. And Lee's on a little woman. notify for the next four days. So how's the shoot going? We're having the best time. The director, Cecil Evans, is so much fun. We're making the coolest movie and partying all the time. What's his profession? And he likes to watch me pee. <laughs> I got a man. How long have you had this boyfriend? About three months. Nobody. I didn't steal any of them. They just jump shit. <laughs> what? <laughs> so what's your story, Abby and Abby? Oh, Abby's got the baby. I had a set crush on Cecil. Set crush? Please. You were his set wife. <laughs> were and had being the key words here. Yeah, he's a stand-in. You need to get over that shit. That was two weeks ago. She's so pizzazzy, ain't she? Mm -hmm. Zoe, Kim, and I are in the Philippines at an outdoor raid. Oh, you're working on three kicks to the head, part three. And admittedly, <laughs> there was there three kicks to the head. Three kicks to the head, part three. <laughs> so, Zoe, I'm right at the edge of a seven foot concrete ditch. There he goes. I probably would have broken my. Neck. He doesn't even yelling. have to try to stalk because they're loud as hell. <laughs> when we first started dating, you were like that. So just so loud in restaurants. I had to learn this little You'd be spatial thing. starts fucking around. <laughs> Zoe falls in the ditch and it's nothing. We're laughing about it. <laughs> if I fell in that thing, I probably would have been paralyzed. Oh, <laughs> you can't think like that. You know? Right. We all have our individual talents and that just happens to be one of Zoe's. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Physically speaking, Zoe is amazing. I mean, agility, reflexes, nimbleness. You human beings that can f with Zoe on that front. Kim, I like you too. <laughs> Haven't said that. So Kim, you still pack a Roscoe? <laughs> Ooh, nice one, mate. What's a Roscoe? Roscoe's a pistol. I was wondering the same thing. I was like, <laughs> yeah, that was just so random to ask her though. <laughs> but it's Texas, yeah. so it's like. I want to do my laundry when I fall. I want to do my laundry. <laughs> right. There are other things you can carry. Do that junk at two in the morning if you want to. Pepper spray. Mother, I try to. Me? I don't want to give him a skin rash. <laughs> I want to shut that. How about a knife at least? You know what happens to motherfuckers carry knives. Who the hell is she though? They get You want to go knife shot. fight somebody? <laughs> the hell? So Zoe, you thought about what you want to do first? It just so happens. I know exactly what I want to do. I want to drive a Dodge Challenger. <laughs> it has to be a 1970 Dodge Challenger with a 440 engine. But well, she's specific. <laughs> oh. I've been getting the paper for the last month, and I've been checking the classified at the back looking at cars for sale. So, as of yesterday, for sale in this town, some dude is selling a stock 1970 Dodge Challenger with a 440 engine and a white paint job. And you want to buy it? Um, I may be stupid, but I'm not bloody stupid. I thought I his car was a Dodge. Life, so he'll let me test drive it. Or a Chevy. What do you horny gals want? <laughs> he means literally, I guess. Yeah, you got a 1970 Dodge Challenger for sale? Right up here, ladies. What a crazy way to meet someone. What do you horny girls want? Well, they're honking <laughs> the horn. That man don't miss an opportunity, does he? <laughs> I was about to say, it's clean under there. Uh, if you'll excuse me for a moment, I'd just like to have a word alone with my business associate. You ladies take your time. <laughs> <laughs> what? He said, mmm. What are you waiting for? Ugh. Ask him what you drive it by yourself. I iron tin first. I need to ask you something. What? If he lets us take it out on our own, I want to play ship's mast. Down Ain't no way I'm doing ship's mast. You need two people to play ship's mast. And I am. Maybe they switch seats when they're. Oh, when no. they're driving or something? I have no idea. There's some gearheads, so it has to be frame. something to do with like car culture or something in a movie or something. Mm -hmm. I'll crack your back. So you're probably right. She kind of looks like Uma Thurman. Like you her my back. vibe. Mm -hmm. So we're going to see if this guy lets take the car out without him. If he does, you wait here with Lee and we'll be back in a moment. What? I said, we're going to see if this guy lets take the car out without him. I heard he what you said. I just can't leave. Wait. <laughs> you're not going to want to do what we're doing. <laughs> what? To drive a car? We're doing more than that. What? Drive it fast? We're doing more than that. Actually, we're paying you a compliment because we're going to do some stupid shit. <laughs> I'm starting to think you're right. Okay. How about this? I'll talk him in. But if I talk him into it, I go along. How are you going to do that? Ah! 
That's my problem. But don't worry, he'll say yes. What are you gonna do, blow him? No. I'm gonna insinuate that Lee's gonna blow him. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, that's so jacked up. Go work your magic. <laughs> Why is she so excited? <laughs> Hello, sir. Hello, what's your name? Jasper. Hello, Jasper. I'm Abernathy. <laughs> Ever what? Abernathy. What's your first name? That is my first name. <laughs> what kind of first name? You know what? Just call me Abby. Okay. <laughs> Abby. Jasper, we were wondering if my friends and I could take the car out for a little test drive out on our own. You know, just to see if we're... Why would I do something stupid like that? To better sell your automobile. How do I know y'all ain't just gonna steal it? We are not thieves. <laughs> While we're taking the car out for a little spin, that'll give you a better opportunity to get acquainted with our other friend. Lee. Why does she look kind of familiar? That would be because she's a famous actress. Why is she dressed like that? Well, you see, we're making a Hollywood movie in town, and it's a cheerleader movie, and she's one of the cheerleaders. A cheerleader movie? A movie about cheerleaders. <laughs> a porno movie? Yes, it is. <laughs> but don't mention it. She's shy. <laughs> <laughs> This is Jasper. Jasper Lee. Now you two kids stay out of trouble. Hey, good looking. Be back to pick you up later. Ta-ta. But why does she agree to it? She didn't. She was napping. Yeah, but I'm saying, why is she napping? That's my <laughs> whole thing. Why? What's up with her? <laughs> you get what I'm saying, though? You wouldn't have caught me sleeping around that dude. <laughs> I'm a grown man. I ain't about to sleep by that dude. <laughs> Stick his tongue up my ass. <laughs> Yo, where are you going? You stay put. Yo, I gotta take a. Oh, look at that pumpkin worm. So you ready to do this? You sure? You want to start out on top? Practically doesn't count if you start on the top. Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! Damn, I don't get the joke. I will in a little bit. <gasps> the gloves. The biker coat. Yeah, they're about to do some stunt stuff. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I think I hear a car coming. Well, fuck that. Get out of Benathy's belt. What are you doing? What are they doing? <laughs> Give me a belt. No. Prada. It's nice to be nice, Kim. Oh, they're about to ride on you know top what? of the car. Don't There's even no way. think about asking me next time you want me to do your hair. Yo ass gonna do like it. using the belt to hold on. I guess so. I ain't getting that shit. Abernathy, don't get on my nerves right now. I got shit on my mind. Oh, Ooh. Well, I don't think this is gonna go good. We're gonna get another scene like we got earlier. Yeah, he probably is gonna love tracking them down in that thing. Faster. Whoa. Oh. Faster! <laughs> Y'all are wild. <laughs> well, we've come a long way since Lord of the Rings. <laughs> is that how she gets off or something? I'm not trying to be perverted, but like, you know, this is just the vibe we're in, right? I mean, if you're like a stunt person, maybe you just, that's what you do on your weekends. Maybe this is just exhilarating to her or something. Yeah, but it's hard to see when you're driving. I used to think the back seat in the station wagon was cool. Oh, when you was a kid? Yeah. <laughs> He's this like, type of girl right there. He's like, oh yeah. Oh no, he has the seatbelt on. The double seatbelt. <laughs> They're like, this is my best part, dude. <laughs> Watch this. <sh> <laughs> you know the crackhead earlier I was talking about? Mm -hmm. Or a crankhead, whatever you want to call it. No, this man's wild. Like, y'all have no idea. It's not even your car. She can't hang on. Oh, I thought they were about to spin out. No, they're stunt drivers too. No. Did you do something to me? Did you say something? Nothing. Shit, here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Mm. Oh, I'm going. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What 
in the world. Ah! Uh oh. No. Yeah, this would be a great time to carry right now, wouldn't it? Pop, pop. You see him hype? Now they gotta buy that car. They have no choice. My God. <laughs> <laughs> He's crazy. You tried to kick it away. <laughs> you just can't. Eat. What? Why don't they try just slowing down just to, like enough to get her off the hood? Because then he'll just fly by, right? I mean, you don't have to slam on your brakes, but you can definitely slow down a lot really fast. It's crazy that she's still on the hood. That's your opportunity. <laughs> did they let her off the hood? No, they kept going, didn't they? What did they call it? Full mass? She went full mass like the whole time. I'm gonna like, drop it down to about 25. I'll jump. Crawl off to the side. Oh my god. <laughs> hey! Woohoo! <laughs> That was fun. <laughs> For who? Well, adios. Oh! Why in the hell are you just now pulling it out? Because she was driving. <laughs> so? Because I was thinking earlier, I was like, she was must it on just, her leg? Well, I thought she left her gun or something. Because I was like, why are you not shooting them? You shouldn't have it concealed so much you can't even pull it out. That's the whole point. I'm okay. She just went camping or something. Oh, yeah, she's a cat. He's about to ram so, into him or something. Where's the maniac? I shot him in his- I shot him. Let's kill this bastard. Uh-oh. <laughs> She's pissed. What is going on? Oh, good thing there's some steel rods right there. <laughs> oh, look how she gets in the car. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, she's, oh, she's got a joust on his butt. That's what we need. <laughs> what? I just can't with this movie. It's so crazy. Like, if I had to make up a movie, I don't think in a million years I would make this movie. Quentin Tarantino is like, I got a great idea. A great idea. She's on the hood. And she's. <laughs> I'm the bartender. It's all fun and games till he gets shot, you know? You know, when people like this murder people and then they get shot and they cry about it, it's just so bizarre. Like he was tough as hell ramming that thing. What are you gonna do? Uh oh. Oh my he didn't even on him that was like on 50 first date kind of, it was kind of like that but not really was it she had a pink shirt and a bat and was beating him it was significantly more violent do you think they took that from this in a way maybe like, you know a little a little homage now they're chasing him <laughs> they're just flirting this is like a flirty movie is that yeah they're flirting because i think they really hate him <laughs> see i told you it's like a daredevil flirting movie this movie's very deep. <laughs> <laughs> it's like if you have a need for speed and you're like super into that, here it is. No! Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Good old Texas. <laughs> I don't ever go first. I've been chasing them again. <laughs> This is actually a long car chase. That's the ramp I was talking about. <laughs> the guy didn't do anything. Wrong place at the wrong time. 
I would not be able to be in the car with him. With who? Him, because I would be scared we would hit a deer the whole time. Well, I hope you wouldn't want to be in the car with him. This car sucks. <laughs> well, I'm just saying, if he was my Uber driver, I'd be like, uh-uh. Tarantino's like, want to do a car chase? I'll show you how to do a car chase. Watch. <laughs> of all the car chases I've seen, which has been like two, unless you count Marvel ones. But how many has there been, though? Not a lot. I don't think we've ever seen one. Uh, this is our first car chase. I would say this is the best one I've seen. This is the most sexual car chase I've ever seen, that's for sure. She's like Samuel. <laughs> Here's Cha Cha. <laughs> oh, the tides have turned. Do you think they'll run out of gas? Like, that's what I think the whole time I see car situations. They're famous people, right? In a sense, well, kinda. They're trying to be. There's about to be some damn murderers. I know that guy's guilty too, but geez. <laughs> I don't think you can do this. Might be a little too much. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> yeah. This is like when the superhero is running on the building top, about to jump on you. He's about to just get popped, isn't he? But it's death proof. So he's good. <laughs> she said, This is my face. Uh oh. Be careful, my right arm's broken. Oh, 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 I'll give it to him. He's got some. He's got some strong legs under him, don't he? <laughs> <laughs> My man should be laid out. That's a, that's a tough mug right here. <laughs> no way. There's no way that's the end. Is that really the end? Guys. <laughs> you know what? Oh wait, wait, wait. Guys, if y'all had any fun here, man, like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> I don't, really, I don't even want to talk about this movie. It was just crazy as hell. You guys saw what the reaction. What was that? <laughs> I don't really know what I can add to that. That was just two hours of crazy as hell. So uh, <laughs> we're going to move on. What's the next Tarantino movie? Inglorious Bastards. Inglorious Bastards is next. So if you had any fun here, man, definitely come hit us back up on the channel. We're going to finish the Tarantino verse. Just a crazy ass movie that got messed <laughs> with the wrong ones. And he should have just, he should have just. Stopped while he was ahead, I guess. Right, he chose I mean, the wrong he, he got out of that one somehow and he just kept going. Do you have any final thoughts? Do you have any words of wisdom to Estelle? <laughs> no. I don't either. I don't know what the heck to say. That was just like, <laughs> I felt like we just went to car chase world and we've never been there before. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm just glad I don't mess with, glad I ain't messing with them bitches. So uh, <laughs> I'll see you guys on the next one, man. Peace.